Uh, what is up guys welcome back to another brand new video so today i am very excited okay because i'm gonna be playing with the brand new dragon ball z uh slash super remaster mod uh inside of uh, people playground now i play with this a little bit just to see how it works i also looked up the video how, on how all the new mechanics and new animations work also sorry my voice sounds kind of weird uh i don't know why but ever since yesterday i've just had a weird voice so right, so how does this work so first of all we have the dragon balls you spawn these in you quote unquote grant a wish right uh these don't actually do anything from what i know like i tried like testing them but they don't do anything so um, uh, Patara earrings, these do work, if you put them on two people, they will combine and fuse. If they don't work on two random people that are, like, not, like, canon, they have to, like, be canon. Like, Goku and Vegeta, or, like, Frieza and Cool. maybe, I don't know if those two are gonna work, maybe, not a promise. Sensu Bean, uh, this is gonna heal you from, uh, non-fatal wounds. Then we got the basic Uzaru ape, right? Then we got a golden one, Goku, Vegeta, Frieza, Beerus, and everyone, pretty much. We don't have that many characters we got like decent amount but for now we only have these like uh, characters because the animations take a long time to add so or make whatever for now let's just add a basic ozaro ape right just a basic ozaro ape and then let's spawn in goku and then we're gonna try to kill this ozaro ape okay so he's very big as you can see now how does this work you click on the head apparently and then you get to see like all the things he has right so he has, first of all, he has a skins menu. Not everyone has this, only a couple of them. You get to change his battle damage or battle armor, right? I kind of want to go for this one, which is slightly damaged. Um, and actually, no, you know what? You know what? I'm going to change it to the classic one. Uh, where is it at? Classic Goku. Like, this one looks the best, yeah. I think there's also the one where he uses Spirit Bomb against, like, Majin Buu. Could be wrong, though. No? um and then oh yeah we need to enable for now let's just go oh yeah and as you can see there is uh transformations kaioken all his techniques and these are all his transformations as you uh as you can see base super saiyan super saiyan 2 super saiyan 3 super saiyan 4 super saiyan god super saiyan blue god whatever that, that one is called super saiyan uh ui uh super, did i say super saiyan ui my bad uh ui mastered ui ui omen sign um after granola arc or post granola arc so for now uh let's just do a basic key let's see if that even does anything i think we're supposed to go up to super saiyan 2 to even like do anything to him from what i know all right here we go so first of all this is a super saiyan basic super saiyan okay basic super saiyan let's get him closer to uzaro ape yeah see his punches don't do anything uh enable Kamehameha. I look as you can see, they updated the animation of the Kamehameha. Look how good it looks now. And get ready for what I told you guys ready? Look at that. Look how good that looks. That is so high quality. Uh, and there's also a uh, super or ultra Kamehameha, whatever that's called. Oh, we actually managed to do something to him. He's getting pushed back. But wait, let me make sure he's on his feet again because th the problem is I don't want him to like. Like, I want to, like, go for, like, an instant kill, because if he falls, it's gonna mess everything up, and it's gonna be hard to, like, hit my thing, you know? But, from what I know, Super Saiyan 1 is still not enough to even damage him, so Super Saiyan 2, and let's also enable... You know what, let's go for a Super Kamehameha with this. If this is still not enough, we're gonna have to go Super Saiyan 3, and let's try to aim for the head this time. Alright, here we go, you guys ready? 3, 2, 1. Look how good that looks! Damn, that is even better than the base Kamehameha, I mean, obviously, yo, alright, we're gonna go back to the basic one, because that's, uh, Ultra 1 is too powerful, and then the rest will just, like, do this, you know, um, okay, nice, okay, and then, so, and there's also Gohan Beast, Master, you know what we should do later in the video, and Master, uh, Master Ultra Instinct Goku, and then put Maximum Kaioken on top of him, you know, but first things first, I wanna see how this works, the Patara earrings, does this actually work? Oh, it does, and it turns into Vegito from what I know. Yeah, but Gogeta, like Gogeta, you're gonna have to spawn him in manually. You know what? Let's have a let's have a fight with Gogeta and Broly. Okay, uh, let me put them like not too close to each other, uh, and then put them like I'm gonna put them more towards the middle. There we go. Uh, and then our uh, like you know what? We're not even gonna bother with like we just is wait. There's Super Saiyan for Gogeta. That's pretty awesome. Wow. 
All right, we're instantly going to go to the maximum transformations. We're not going to mess around, right? Uh, oh, wait. Where did Broly... Oh, okay. He spun over there. I was, I was kind of weird. All right, and then... So, okay, wait. First thing is first. Let's see. Star we got Stardust Breaker. We got Big Bang. Come here, come here. We got... Okay, Meteor Explosion. What is Meteor Explosion again? Wait, like, which one is that? Oh, I think I know which one this is. Let me put him closer. I need to put him closer for this one. Yeah, it's like the thing that... Uh, to see if he's evil. Now, if he's evil, he should, like get killed by this attack he's not let me quickly try that again let me spawn in freeze i don't freeze as evil to the core uh oh wait i spawned him in the wrong direction hold on i right, this attack should work on frieza if frieza doesn't like yeah see he died from it it worked nice good 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 okay so i know it works all right but that's not gonna work on bro because he's not evil uh what about stardust Crap, I did not mean to use that one. I, I went for the wrong attack. I right, here we go. I got my Stardust Breaker, whichever one this is. This is the one they use on uh, Janemba, right? This one can also, like, this is a better version. This, even if they're, like, slightly evil, it works. Or I guess not. All right, well, let's see. Um, What does Broly have? Gigantic Crusher and Gi... <coughs> okay, we're going to have them do... A uh, beam struggle. I, let me make sure uh, Gogeta's far away this time. Gogeta, I'm gonna go. Uh, Big Bang Kamehameha might be too powerful. I'll do a basic one. Gogeta should still be able to win this even with a basic Kamehameha. Alright, so let's see. Let me freeze him. Three, two, one. Oh, I think I know what's happening. His attack is stronger, but it doesn't actually do anything to Gogeta because. Um, he's like, like insanely powerful. It's just, all right, let me give him a shot. Let me give him big bang. Let me just go to the instant, like strongest mode then of his, uh, you know, and also Broly aim a bit more downwards because you're aiming way too high. One. Oh, I did that. That was bad timing. Wait, is Broly actually not getting injured by this? Is that because he's frozen? Let me unfreeze him. Oh, there we go. No, Broly went on his knees. He's in, like he's still alive after that attack. Yeah, there we go. And then uh, as Gogeta, I'm going to try to use my Stardust uh, Breaker thing on it. See if it works. Oh my god, that's massive. Oh crap. A right, 3, 2, 1. Oh my god. Okay, wait, wait. I want to make Broly throw it at us. Oh crap. Oh, nothing's- Oh, crap. Alright, well, I don't know what just happened, but, hey, Gogeta survived it. Um, wait, let me- Okay, I'm gonna use this on Broly, see if he survives it. He survives it. Wow, insane. I- This time I'm gonna put Broly or Gogeta much further away. Boom! Broly, um, if you survive this, you're insane. And also, the Kamehameha goes, like, infinite distance unless it hits something, aka Broly, and then it disappears, right? Was that- Oh, yeah, that was strong enough. Apparently, it's stronger than the Big Bang Kamehameha, I think. Unless, like, it only- The Big Bang Kamehameha only gets stronger if Gogeta Super Saiyan 4 uses it, you know? But let's get rid of that. Alright, they had their fun. Let's go- I want to go for- Okay, I want to have Super Saiyan or, or Gohan Beast, right? Fight Super Saiyan, or not, I keep saying Super Saiyan. Uh, fight, uh, go, uh, I want, okay, I want go. um, I, I want Gohan Beast to fight, uh, free, uh, Black Frieza. That's something I want to see, like, what, what's gonna happen, right? Transformations, instantly go to Black Frieza, and then, uh, Gohan, oh yeah, the skins menu, right? Let's go for, uh, that one, and then let's go for Gohan Beast. Alright, for this one, I think, I, okay, so from what I know, all right, let's see. Black Frieza is insanely strong, so let's go. Let's go for Misenko first, and then for Frieza, let's go for uh, Death Ball, that Death Beam, no Energy Wave, right? Yeah. All right, here we go. All right, you guys ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. Who's gonna be the strongest? Fight! Holy crap! Black Black Frieza just soloed Go on like it was nothing. Black Frieza just pummeled Go on into. He just disintegrated Gohan. Wait, okay, but to be fair, Gohan was using Masenko. So let's see, let's use a Super Kamehameha on him, okay? That was insane, wow. We're straight, we're not gonna even do basic Kamehameha, we're going to Super Kamehameha because Black Frieza is a monster from what I know. Jesus, 
he disintegrated Gohan from existence. I wonder if that's also gonna happen in the anime. If Gohan Beast is gonna lose to Black Frieza. 3, 2, 1, go! Oh my god, and it's not even close. Black Frieza. Okay, Black Frieza is just that much stronger than Gohan Beats, I guess. Wow, I wonder if I can fuse Gohan with um, Goku. I wonder if that's possible. Let me see. Let's see if that's possible. Oh, I completely missed that. Oh, they're not able to get fused, I see. What about what about Frieza and Cooler? Really? Uh what else should I try next? What should I try? Let me spawn in a golden Uzaru and let me see if Super Saiyan 4 Goku is enough to beat him, okay? We're gonna go with Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Or actually, I've not been Super Saiyan 3 yet, right? Let me quickly go Super Saiyan 3 to show you guys how it looks like. That's how Super Saiyan 3 looks like. Does he have the Dragon Attack with this or no? Oh, he even has a Genki Dama. That's sick. Alright, Super Saiyan 4 with the uh, Super Kamehameha. Let's see if this is enough. This should, in theory, be enough to beat him. Man, I wish, I wish Baby was in here. Yep, that's enough to beat him. Nice. Because Super Saiyan 4 is like a little bit much stronger than this like Golden Uzari thing. It's the same thing essentially, but just, you know. Okay, now let me spawn in a Beerus. Now Beerus, from what I know, is insanely strong no matter what he, like power level he's at. So we're just going to do his weakest form, see if we're going to be able to beat him. For now, let's just do basic Kamehameha or like all, uh, basic Super Kamehameha. This is probably not even going to scratch him or even make him move. So let's see. I already know he's alive after that. So we're going to get ready to use Master Ultra Instinct with Maximum Kaioken to kill him. Because, yeah, see? Wait, let me see if I can make him weaker. Yeah, you see? Hakaishin mode, 100%, 50, 25. Okay, use base. Uh, all right, his weakest one yet. Uh, and then, let's see. We're instantly gonna go to... Wait, what is this one, though? Like, I know what, what it is, but, like... Oh, and apparently if you click on the head, it activates after, like, after images. So he starts dodging, like, by, by himself. You guys see how, like... Yeah, you see that, guys? That's, just, that's the new Ultra Instinct uh, animation thing. Alright, here we go. I already know this is not gonna be enough, so I'm gonna turn on Kaioken times 20. Not only that, but I'm also got okay. We also got a Hakai. If this doesn't work, then we're gonna use Hakai on him and then Genki Dama too. Beerus, if you survive this, you're a monster. That's all I'm gonna say, okay? Three, two, one. Let's see if you can survive it. I think he survived it. I already know he survived this. I already know he's gonna survive it. But that this is the first though. He's starting to move a little bit with that. That means that we're somewhat getting close. But if this is only enough to make a move, then okay, it's time for Genki Dama. Alright, let's see. He survived it. Okay, we're gonna do something insane. We're gonna do something insane. Strong right now. Alright, here we go. Alright, he's getting Hakai. Let's see if he's actually gonna Hakai him. If this isn't Hakai Beerus that is the weakest form, then we just don't stand a chance. We're gonna have to go fusion. Yep, we're gonna have to go fusion then. Or you know what? Actually, wait. Before I do that, before I do that, wait. Disable um this. This is Mastered Ultra Instinct Goku, right? Let's spawn in uh, Vegito, or not Vegito, Vegeta, and let's uh, make him go Ultra Ego, and let's have them have a um, beam struggle one more time as the strongest form, right? Alright, there we go. Oh, crap. Did I just kill Ultra Ego uh, Vegeta with that? Wait. Oh, I did! I don't think it even matters if he fires first. Goku is just that much stronger than him. Okay, then. But anyways, that's that. What else can I do? Ultra Ego, I've already done Ultra Ego. Ultra this, Ultra that. Zamasu. Um, oh, let's have a Teen Gohan fight for his uh, cell like Kamehameha stand up. That would be sick. Here we go, Beam Struggle. Oh, look at that, that's sick. This one is the best one yet. This one actually is accurate too. Nice. Slow motion right now and then fast motion. Like, look how cool that is.